hey everyone welcome back to my channel i hope you all are fit and fine so today i have received this dell latitude 3189 laptop and this laptop condition is dead it's uh, not turning on so now i will try to fix this laptop so let's try to fix it okay this is a motherboard part number la-e371p so at first i will check main power rail evidence so i set my multimeter in deep mode and that first i will check this uh, dc connector positive line here as you can see it's clear no beep or no not showing any value that means this line is clear now i will check any of this uh, 13 volt filtering capacitor in this motherboard so let's check there is no shot as you can see so now I will connect my DC power supply to this motherboard so I connect this <coughs> power supply and I look at my power supply it's not taking any ampere so let me do another thing so I just remove this RDC battery from this motherboard so if there is no problem in this motherboard it will turn on after remove this CMOS battery so I connect my DC power supply again but uh, as you can see it's same it's not turning on so now I will check and will measure some required voltage in this motherboard at first I will check this 19 volt in DC jack as you can see it's 19 volt it's clear and perfect next I will check 13, 13 volt so i can check here as you can see 13 volt is present so next i will check 3 volt and 5 volt always voltage so this one should be 5 volt okay we have 5 volt it's perfect next volt is 3.3 .3 volt always so as you can see 3.3 .3 volt is not present so let's check this 3.3 3, 3 volt, 3 .3 volt regulator IC under my microscope. So I don't have schematic or board view for this specific model. So I have only this IC data sheet as you can see here. So now I will check this IC according to this data sheet. So let's connect DC power supply again. So now I will check this uh, regulator IC. So as you can see, so in and in and in. Uh, so this is. Uh, 3.3 volt regulator i see here as you can see so first i will check uh, g p in voltage this is a p number two three four five this is a common line here so this is a one two three four five this should be 13 volt oh sorry so we have 13 volt present and then next i will check VCC pin number 17 these are called or say LDO voltage so 3.3 volt should be present that pins uh, so 1 2 3 4 5 10 15 16 17 so let's check this pad here we have 3.3 volt present VCC next is uh, enable voltage pin number 11 so 10 and 11 so we have uh, 3, 3 volt and the volt is also present in this IC so in this condition now I will check uh, evidence in this 3.3 volt power rail okay as you can see it's uh, getting beep in this coil that means this 3.3 uh, volt power rail is struck the ground so now i'm going to inject the voltage from my power supply so i need to set my power supply in 1.3 or 2 volt so 
let's connect this ground to ground and this positive inject in this three volt three volt power rail okay as you can see it's taking almost five amps that means this uh, line fully shot so i need to check with my thermal sensor let's check this other side okay i can feel i can feel hot right here i can see also something garbage as you can see this caps look like bad so let's check this side of the minute okay it's getting beep here so let's remove those first remove this cap this looks so nasty oh it's already broken here as you can see so let's check this again okay no more shots here as you can see there's no beeps no shots so let's clean this area So let's replace the you know, have to Yeah. So here you go. Oh, Angus. Angus, let's clean this area okay it's look like nice and smooth okay it's done so let's check this ingredients again okay no more whips it's clear so let's connect the charger again and it's turn on as you can see it's turn on so it's time to check the display restart come on baby
okay we have this beautiful Dell logo so it's done we successfully fixed this laptop so my beautiful viewers if you like this video please hit the subscribe button press the bell icon if you already subscribed my channel thank you so much if you watch my video from my facebook page so please share my video play and like comments thank you so much see you in the next video until then stay well bye bye